Welcome everybody, this is your boy Gerardo Matoro and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like this video, smash the like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more gaming content and we're going to get straight into the video. But before we do get straight into the video, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to the supporters that's on my screen. A big shout out to Samai aka, Doriolo G, Crazy Boss V31, Foxy, Wee's GNZ Gaming and even Moldy Superman YT. Now these people are our channel members on our YouTube platform and I would like to give a big shout out and thank you for their support. So with that all said, let's get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, now before we do get straight into the video, I just wanted to let you guys know I do not know how to pronounce the name of the heist, so I'm just going to say it out and if I do get it wrong, then let me know in the comments. With that all said, welcome everybody, this video is all about the KO Preco heist in single player, and I will be showing you guys on how to install this mod. So. All you guys got to do is go inside my description and now download and install all of the latest requirements that's inside my description below. If you do not know how to install the requirements, then I do have a video inside my description below on how to install the most important files in 2021. So make sure you go and do watch the video first and then watch this one. So once you have finished installing your requirements, then I will leave this mod inside my description below. So make sure you download this mod, and I will leave this mod inside my description below. Now this mod does require enable all interiors, so I will leave this mod inside my description below, so make sure you download this as well. Once you have completed that process, then we can get started. All you gotta do is go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, Hover over it, right click, and open file location. Now as you can see, I have already installed my requirements, so I don't need to show you how to do that. Once you have finished with that, then go to your scripts folder. Remember, your scripts folder must be all lowercase, and it must be spelt correct. Open up your scripts folder, and make sure you do have native UI, .dll, and XML, both files inside your scripts folder and make sure that they are both the latest version version 1.9.1 .1. so all you got to do is open up your heist extract folder okay and then now inside that folder will be another folder then all you got to do is select all the files and drag it inside your scripts folder exit out of your heist extract folder and open up your enable or interiors extract folder now there will be another folder so open up that folder now all you got to do is select all the files and folder and drag it inside your scripts folder now this will pop up just replace your files and then that's all you got to do exit out of your extract folder go back to your grand theft audio v main folder right click refresh your game folder Exit out of your game folder, right click, refresh your desktop, and I'll see you all in the game. And we are back and we are with Franklin. So as you guys can see, I'm at the docks right now, but you don't need to be at the docks. You can use your phone to do this. It's totally up to you. But I would rather go to the docks and do it at the docks because the submarine just spawns right there, right in front of you. So... When you are in the game, the first thing that you must do before you go and do the heist is that you must spawn the submarine. So, the first thing that we must do is open up our phone. Go to contacts. Go right down to the bottom. And all you got to do next is go to the uh, submarine options. Now wait for a few seconds. And now the first thing that we must do is that we must buy the submarine. Now go over here and now buy the submarine now with this next step i'm just going to skip all this because all this is to do with colors and flags and 
buying missiles and etc so I'm just going to skip all this and now you can save your changes okay just go right down the bottom and it says save colors press enter and now your colors is saved back out okay and now all you guys got to do is open up your phone again go to context again go right down to the bottom and now go to enable interiors wait for a few seconds then now go to change and interior now go right down to the bottom now make sure that you go over here first and make sure all this is true except for this one make sure that's false then go to your misc options now the very first thing that you must do is enable load mp maps on mod refresh and enable blips now this is optional you can't do this if you want to but i always do this go to random color blips and now enable that too now back out and go to refresh mods interiors now wait for a few seconds and now back out now the last thing that you must do is go on your keyboard and press insert now your game will freeze for a few seconds and now there it goes now we are going to go to the submarine and now we are going to see the proof that it does work and go into the sub and then there you go and I'm walking in and here it goes and as you guys can see I did not fall underneath the map um, inside the sub now I'm not going to give you guys a tour around the whole submarine everybody knows what's inside here so all you guys got to do is come to this white marker over here and then now press E and then you have started the heist now you got to meet Davy so Davy is at the airport and he's over here so go and meet Davy and now let's see if this works and yep it does now I'm not going to watch this whole um, intro okay so I'm just going to skip this by pressing enter and now we will see that some people inside GTA 5 mods.com some people say is that they fall underneath the map as soon as they get to the island so let's check this out to see if I do fall underneath the map and as you guys can see I did not fall underneath the map now go to the vehicle and now I'll just travel all the way over there but I'm not gonna do the heist okay guys because it will take a long time to actually do the whole thing so I'm just going to skip through this whole thing so you guys can see the proof that it does work still okay okay as you guys can see now we are nearly there and we are just going to go and do a turn on my nice drift uh, and then now we're here and now it's done now skip that and now as you guys can see we are in the party now and we are actually over here so yeah that is it guys okay so the mod does work it still works and I hope you guys do enjoy the mod and we're back again so I hope you guys do enjoy that mod that mod is an awesome mod and it still works 100% so if you guys do get stuck installing this mod then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that or if you do get stuck installing any other mods then please let me know in the comments and I will help you out on that as well if you guys do need help or support I do have a discord server open and I will leave that inside my description below so go and check that out okay all my social media is inside my description below as well so with that I'll see you guys if you guys did enjoy this video or if this video was helpful then smash that like button and subscribe for more gaming content and tutorials and i'll see you all on my next video thank you for watching peace and i'm out